So excuse my glowy face, but I have been at work all day. I'm filming this on a Wednesday and I thought I'd do a little pregnancy slash baby update. So in terms of my actual pregnancy, same as normal, except I'm finding it harder to go upstairs because of the extra weight. I get out of breath easier. And because of the really hot weather that we've been having, it's been really warm and I it, I struggle more. I think I'm struggling a lot more with stairs and things like that because of the heat. So yeah, that was a big thing. But overall, nothing's changed on that respect. I did make a few purchases off of Amazon and I literally just bought this little um, bin from Amazon for the baby's room. Um, I need to undent that, but yeah, it's just a plain little bin that I bought just to pop in the corner of her room for like little nappies and things. And then since last week, we have put some curtains up. So there wasn't curtains in this room before, but there is now. So I got this changing mat off of Amazon. It's got little sheep on it and it's easily wipeable and easily transportable. So I just picked that up and I'm gonna keep it in the living room. I also have a few bags of clothes that I've been given that I need to go through and have a look at and wash and organize and pop in her wardrobe. So I'll do that on the weekend. So I have finally finished my cleaning. I'm a little bit out of breath, if you may notice, but I just wanted to show you some things that I picked up recently that are from Matalan. So I only got three things, but I thought I'd show you because one of them in particular is like really cute. But the first thing is this t-shirt. Now I know it's really huge, but obviously as everybody knows, I'm pregnant and I need oversized t-shirts right now in this hot weather. So this is perfect. It might have water on it because I've just been mopping the floor, as you know. Um, but yeah, it's super oversized. I've never been to Tokyo, but I don't like care uh, about that. I just wanted something that was big and, you know, baggy and comfortable. And yeah, I like this. It was £10. I have another really oversized t-shirt that I picked up when I was on holiday. I think I was on holiday. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, so now I've got two really oversized t-shirts to the point where in like a year's time, when hopefully I'm back to pretty much what I was before, this t-shirt will be freaking massive basically so uh we shall see about that but yeah it's a kind of t-shirt that you would give birth in because it's just so comfortable but yeah i'm happy with this i really like the color hard for me to dress right now in this weather but the cutest things that i've picked up so basically matalan have their autumn range in at the minute and it, all of it looks really great now i already have a lot of like pumpkin ornaments autumn ornaments things like that stashed away ready to get out on September 1st so I tell myself that every year I can get a couple of items that are new to add to my collection and I was looking at all of the Matan stuff and a lot of it I think is a little bit overpriced uh, well not necessarily overpriced but if you compare it to places like Primark then I'm like oh I'd rather go to Primark and get it cheaper but I did see this one thing here which is a little pumpkin sign. It says hello autumn on it. And it's just somewhere that you can sit it cutely. I think I'm gonna just pop all of my autumn stuff in the one room, so in my living room and just fully kind of decorate that and not really focus on the rest of the house because then it will be like super autumn-y having everything in one room. Um, but yeah, this was five pounds and I was happy to pay that um, because everything else was like £15 um, but yeah I thought it was like a nice thing to add to my collection but yeah this is what it looks like and I just think this is like a really cute sign like that so I know it's a bit early but I'm picking things up when I see them I'm not going to just be like oh I'm not going to buy this now I'll wait like what's the point in waiting and then the best thing that I picked up which I actually thought was really 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 decently priced is this so this is a baby suit this is like an all-in-one um cute little yeah baby clothing thing i'm not very good with words but this is for zero to three months so she will be able to wear this 
um, you know, hopefully actually in October because she's due at the beginning of September. So by the time October comes around, um, she should be able to fit into this. And this was only £5 and I thought that was really good for £5. And it basically just says on it, number one pumpkin picker. This is actually the only piece of clothing that I have bought for my baby at all. Everything else has been given to me, like passed down, second hand or bought for me, which I'm very grateful for, thank God. Um, but yeah, I saw this and I was like, £5 isn't that much. I can't resist. So yeah, I did pick that up. But if you're like into kind of decorating for autumn and into like pumpkins and things like that, go to Matan and check it out because there is a lot of stuff there. There's pillows, there's blankets, there's fluffy pumpkins, there's signs. Yeah, there's loads of stuff there, candles, but I just decided to get this. And this was the only one actually in there as well. So I got the last one that was there. Um, but yeah, so I thought I would just share with you those few little purchases in this section of the video. So thank you for watching this clean with me slash whatever it is, life update video. I will see you in next week's video on Sunday. Goodbye.